Hi, my name is Mr. Mizela. I love stories. I love stories. I love to tell stories. I love stories about animal people, everything. Like I grew up in an African setting where we used to tell stories every evening and I really love telling stories. And um, today's video, I'm not going to share a story about my life. I'm instead going to share a Bible story. And uh, the thing about this story is that it happened in the spiritual realm, like it's a kind of a vision, but I'm just going to share the story literally and uh, pull up lessons from it literally. That means I'm not going to go into interpreting the story. This story is found in the book of Daniel chapter 10 and the story goes like this. Daniel prayed and God heard Daniel's prayers and sent an angel with the answers to Daniel's prayers. Now, on the way to deliver Daniel's prayers, the angel was intercepted by the prince of Persia and they started fighting. Daniel continued praying and at one point God was like, ha, I've sent answers to Daniel's prayers here. Why is he calling on me again? So when God looked down from heaven, he saw that the angel that he sent with Daniel's, with the answers to Daniel's prayers was attacked midway. So that was when God dispatched the archangel Michael to fight the prince of Persia so as to liberate the angel to deliver the answers to Daniel's prayers. This is my story. Now, the lessons from this story, you know, the first lesson from this story is that Daniel fasted and prayed. Like, he fasted and prayed. He gave up something to ask God for something. The second um, lesson from this story is that Daniel kept praying. You know, most of the time we feel like God is super God and when we pray, He hears us, so there's no need to keep reminding Him about prayers. Well, the Bible do says before we came, He knew our thoughts, but the very Bible says say pray without ceasing. So Daniel kept praying even after he had not seen the answers to his prayers. And then the third lesson from this story is that, uh, you know, sometimes we pray and we don't bother to find out the Prince of Persia in our lives. Like, we don't bother to find out what might be um disturbing what might be hindering god from hearing our prayers so it is always very important to look into your life and like i have a video in my channel i did about masturbation please click you can go down to my channel and watch like in that story my situation was my prince of peace like it was something that was hindering my prayers so it's always very important to look around to see what is stopping your prayers from reaching god or what is stopping god's answers to your prayers from reaching you summarily pray keep praying and look out for the prince of peace in your life thank you very much for watching thank you please subscribe to my youtube channel subscribe it's very important please 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 please